Jessica on this wonderful, wonderful, glorious day for their union, their marriage together. We just think that bringing these two families together is just an awesome, awesome thing. I know both of you, you told me earlier, Paul, that you met at Queens College. Jessica knocked on the door, apparently, <laughs> looking for a friend. <laughs> Paul said that they talked and talked and talked after that wonderful occasion yep. that you were brought together. You've been through a lot of interesting times together. You believed in each other. Yep. You counted on each other. And all perfect love casts out all fears. And the two of you, we wish you many, many years of happiness and wonderful grandchildren, right? <laughs> So the first day I met Paul, we were like at ACA playing basketball, and it's been a friendship, a good ride ever since. Paul is like the, probably the best thing that probably happened to my life. Aww. Jess is the best party partner I've ever had. The best probably dance, the second best dance you've been to me, but who's counting? <laughs> so here's to Paul and Jess, to many years of marriage. Uh, I wish you guys 60 years, you know, true love. So hello. Yeah. Today I've witnessed your constant in the bond of marriage before God and each person here present. So by the authority vested in the state of Arizona, the Universal Life Church, and myself, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Oh, oh you may now kiss your bride. Friends, family, and loved one, it is a great honor that I have the privilege to introduce you to Mr and Mrs. Little. Yeah.